Hello everyone, welcome to the Informaticals video. This is Ashutosh from Informatica Global Customer Support and today we are going to discuss how to backup and restore the database in Axon. Before proceeding further, let's discuss the agenda for the today's video. First, we will discuss the need to backup and restore the Axon database. Then we will see how to backup and then we'll, uh, how to restore the Axon database. There are certain circumstances under which we want to backup and restore the Axon database. For example, if you want to have the same data for the multiple Axon instances, if you want to restore the data that you have backed up earlier, if you want to move data from test environment to production environment and vice versa. Axon automatically takes the backup. The last 10 backup can be found at Axon Home DB Backup and that under that Postgres backup directory. To take the backup manually, we need to run axon db backup.sh file under script directory of axon installation directory. To restore the database, we need to shut down the axon services by using the shutdown command first. Once the shutdown is complete, we need to start the Postgres service using the below command. To define the axon environment variable so that the Linux system can access the axon resource at the correct correct location, we need to source export env.sh. We need to run the psql command to restore the backup. Then we need to start Axon using the startup scripts. Once Axon service is running, we need to run the reindexing using the reindexing command under the script directory of Axon solution directory. Let's see the demo to backup and restore the database. Currently, I have opened the Axon server and I am under the Axon installation directory. To backup the Axon database, we need to go to the script directory and run the Axon db backup.sh. We need to give the path of the directory where this backup can be restored after running the, this command. Now my backup has been restored at demo backup directory. Let's just cross verify it by going to the demo backup directory. So here is my Postgres SQL file, which contains the backup of currently Exxon database. Now let's just restore one of the Exxon Postgres SQL file into this Exxon directory. We need to go to the Axon installation and win directory to shut down the Axon services first. Once the Axon services have been stopped, we need to go to the third party app and the script directory to start the Postgres service. So, I am under the third party app script directory and to restart the Postgres service, to type Postgres start. You can verify it by running the Axon status command. So we will see only the Postgres service has been running. Now we have to export the environment variable using the source export env.sh command. Now we need to run the psql command to restore the Axon database. You can ignore the error message related to the role. Once the backup restoration has been completed, we need to restart the Axon services by going to the Axon installation and then win directly.
Once the Exxon services has been restarted, we need to run the reindexing command by going to the Exxon installation directory and then under the script directory. Once the reindexing has been completed, you can verify it by running the Exxon URL in the browser or check the Exxon status under the third party app and script directory. In case of any queries regarding this video or any other video, you can contact us using the below ways. Thank you for watching the video.